Yes, it's a clash that many mark on the calendar. As soon as the draw's released, affectionately known as the Italian Derby, it is always interesting when these two get together. Hello and welcome to Marconi Stadium for tonight's clash between the Marconi Stallions and the Arpia Leichhardt Tigers. A proud history between this pair. Yeah. Simmons put it back in the mixer. Giorgio Speranza got it clear. Convincing. Diaz back in. Great ball! Up you have the lead, simple as that. Delivery from Diaz and a finish from Sean Simmons. The captain strikes for the Tigers. Taken quickly, Giorgio Speranza's in behind. He has support through the middle. Marley is one of them. Good ball, yes, it is there. Still there for Milgate. Huge chance for Marconi. Milgate cries of handball. Danascos is going to give a corner. Again, Speranza. Looks like Marconi have isolated a matchup they can exploit. Malia. Under the pressure of Moata Malo. What about the turn from Malia? Inside the area. Chance for Marconi. Oh, it's brilliant from Mitchell Malia. A moment of magic. And Marconi have an equaliser. Turn them inside out. And... Yuli. Good ball in behind. Malia in behind once again. Cut back to good one. Speranza's there. Can they take their lead back once again? Simmons' delivery is good. Simmons is there. The brothers combine. Josh Simmons with the header. And Nenad Vekic was no chance. And Arpia have the lead once again. And this game continues. The turn on its head. Bixo in behind. No free kick. Huge moment. This one. Bixo around Vekic. It's 3-1 now. Marconi players look to the referee. He waves play on. And Corey Bixo makes it 3-1. Malia, room to move. Trying to skip past Moata Malo. Had to win the ball and he did exactly that. McGill had a hands it back though. Oh, Cardoso left a foot in. What colour will the card be? Oh, there's a bit of afters as well between Bixo and Cardoso. Well, Cardoso is going to see a yellow. Oh, couldn't find Yesich though. Well done by the captain though. Wins it straight back. Milgate. Turns provider again. Cardoso! Oh, good save from Tuxford. That's a brilliant save. It was destined for the top corner. As I say that though, Arpia are often attacking. Josh Simmons, a great ball. Flag stays down. Payne has it for Arpia. A huge moment in this one. And a big save from Vekic. Well, they just couldn't work it out. Arpia at a crucial time. Big so overlapping, threads the needle. Flag stays down, chance. It was pain. Let's see what they're trying to do. They see up here, a little suspect down that flank. Flag stays down. Chris Payne in behind. Huge moment in this one. Payne can make it four. He does exactly that. And surely now it is good night and thank you. Payne gets in on the goal scoring act. And the pain continues for Marconi. Not done just yet. Here's Speranza in the area. Chance for Marconi. Good save by Tuxford. Another look at goal from Speranza. Cries of handball. They'll get a penalty. Well, what? Marco Yesic for Marconi. Oh, he's missed again. He's put it wide again. Simmons unleashes Parisi. Three on three. All of a sudden, Payne offside. Parisi doing it on his own. Now threads the needle. Lovely ball to Bixo. Can they get a five? They probably should have. Still working well. Malia trying to do it on his own. How about the feet from him? He'll continue his run forward. James Andrew gets in behind. Crosses a good one. Yes, it's just there. They have reward now. Well, he's worked hard all night, Marco Yesic. Finally, it goes in for Marconi. Yeah, great. Not with that delivery. Milgate's there. Uchino, is he going to go on his own? He is. Uchino, oh, it's off the crossbar. Uchino, very nearly, put the icing on the cake. And there it is, full time. Well, we knew it would be entertaining. It certainly was that. We saw six goals in the 90 minutes. But it's a fourth straight defeat for Marconi. And it's to their biggest rivals in Apia Leichhardt.